Hello everybody, I'm Artillery J, and welcome to Fantasy Fridays Season 2 Redo. Uh, this is going to be a series playing Final Fantasy IV. Uh, this is the Pixel Remaster version because it's the one that I've got. If you saw the announcement trailer, and then you already know that. Um, let's go ahead and start a new game, and uh, we'll get going. I actually started playing this game... Um, not the Pixel Remaster version, but the uh, original version uh, about six, five, six years ago on the channel. I uh, got one episode out, and then uh, I, I don't remember what happened, but I stopped, I stopped making the videos. Um, I got busy, I guess. Captain, we will arrive at Baron shortly. Very well. The captain seems kind of down. After what we did, who would be? Who wouldn't be? Orders are orders, but killing innocent people to get the crystals isn't right. So this is one of my favorite Final Fantasy games. Uh, probably my second favorite. I really enjoy it. Love the characters. Of course, the music is phenomenal. Always in Final Fantasy games. Uh, the story's pretty decent for this one. So yeah, we'll, we'll be enjoying it together, and hopefully um, we'll, we'll get through the game relatively easily. There will be some points when I stop to grind, um, so I will cut the video, go ahead and grind, and then come back. The Red Wings are supposed to protect people, not harm them. That's enough! But Captain, surely you don't condone what we've done. All of you, listen well. The raid on Mycidia was, imper was imperative for Baron's prosperity. The Mycidians know too much about the crystals. Their very possession of one is a threat to Baron. His Majesty ordered we obtain the crystal, and as soldiers of the Royal Air Force, we are sworn to obey. Captain... Captain, monster sighted, dead ahead. Prepare for battle. Alright, so anyway, uh, there will be points that I stop and grind. And, um, so I will just stop the video and then come back after I've done, I've done my grinding. Um, both for leveling and for, um, hunting for specific rare items. Um, like the summons that drop off of monsters. Um, there is point. Are you alright? We've got more hostiles. Damn, damnation. The dialogue. And it's been changed since the original came out too, which is even funnier. But um, This is all auto battle, so I'm not doing anything. It's just playing itself. Is everyone okay? All accounted for, sir. We've been encountering more monsters than ever lately. There's no end to them. Could it be some kind of omen? Captain, we're approaching Baron. Very well, prepare for landing. So there's going to be a point towards the end of the game that there is an, a specific item that I need to grind for. Um, I believe it's called the Pink Tail in this game. And it drops off of a specific enemy that is only in one room. Uh, the enemy spawn chance is like 0.04%. And only in that one room. And then the drop rate is like 0.01%. So it's very, very rare. Well done. So the crystal is now ours. The city has put up no resistance. In fact, they were completely defenseless. Is this pity I perceive? Hmm. Come, Captain, his majesty awaits. Guy's such a dick. Can't stand him. But I love it. It's, it's one of those characters that you love to hate. You know what I mean? I, I do have to work here in uh, a little bit. So I'm gonna gonna record a little bit and then um and then I'll cut it. If you'll excuse me, Captain, I must speak to his majesty in private. Please wait here. I also have, I made up a, um, like a quick guide for myself, 
in an Excel spreadsheet. Your Majesty, I'm afraid Cecil can no longer be trusted. He clearly questions your authority. He does? Your counsel is well heeded, Bagan. But as long as I obey the crystal but so long as I obtain the crystals, Cecil's transgressions matter little. Send him in. Yes, Your Majesty. Um yeah, anyway, it's it's like a, a quick guide that I made. It's got all of the treasures, hidden items, and monsters in each area. That way I, I can try to not miss anything, but we'll see. We'll see how that works out. Captain, His Majesty summons you. Dude, such a putz. The Kingdom of Baron hails your return. May I have the crystal? Yes, Your Majesty. Handed over the water crystal. It looks genuine to me, sire. It is beautiful to behold. You are dismissed, Cecil. Ugh. Sigh. Your Majesty. Yes? Captain, what is it? Your Majesty, forgive me, but what are your intentions regarding the crystals? My men are confused and displeased at their orders. And what of you? Do you question my command? No, I only ask... Silence! Do not think your treachery has slipped past me. I trust you, Cecil, but you leave me no choice. I hereby relieve you of command of the Red Wings. Your Majesty! Now, I charge you with another duty. Slay the phantom beast that plagues Mist Valley and deliver this bomb ring to the village of Mist. You leave tomorrow at first light. Bomb ring, so it's just it's just a normal piece of jewelry, right? Right? Your Majesty, I beg you to reconsider. Cecil has done no wrong. Ah, Cain, if you are so concerned about your treacherous friend, you may accompany him. Your Majesty. Now, take the ring and be gone. Your Majesty. I'm sorry, Cain. Once we've accomplished the mission, the King is bound to forgive us both. You'll command the Red Wings again in no time. Get some rest. Leave tomorrow's preparations to me. Okay. Mm, okay. Thanks. Um, let me very quickly. So, uh, there are three treasures that I can get in the castle. Um, I'm sure I remember exactly where they're at. Okay, not there. Can I not step on that space? I guess not. Okay, whatever. Thought that was a door, but I guess not. Um, oh, okay, it's right here. There we go. And that'll be it for the castle. Cecil! Thank goodness you're alright. I was so worried. You left us on such short notice. We're fine. I wish I could say the same for the Mycidians we slaughtered. Cecil? I'll come see you later, okay? Very well. Okay, bye. Well, 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 look who's back. Rosa was worried sick about you. Well, hey there, Sid. Won't you ever do that to her again, you hear? So, how are my airships? I'll bet you and your goons wrecked them up something awful. Hey, what's the matter with you, kiddo? Well, what? The king demoted you? What about the Red Wings? They'll be a mess without you. Come to think of it, the king's been acting peculiar for some time. 
His Majesty ordered me to build an airship for killing people. Everyone's worried about him. Anywho, be careful out there. Make short work of that mission and get back safe. Oh, I have to start heading home. My daughter will kill me if I'm not back soon. Uh, love, love the dialogue. Love the dialogue. Anywho, I've changed your sheet, sir. I hear you depart early tomorrow morning. Good night. Man, news travels fast in this kingdom. You know what I mean? All right. Um, yeah, but he's just like the, the king ordered me to to slaughter people or to create a ship that can slaughter people. Um, but anywho, uh, hurry back. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. What's happened to the king? He covets the crystals as though he's possessed. And it seems he'll resort to any means to get them. Nevertheless, I can't defy him. How could I cross the man who raised Cain and me like his very own? The chivalrous knight whom I've adored and admired since childhood. I would not betray him. I can't. Cecil. What's going on? You just returned from Mysidia, and now you must journey afar to battle some phantom beast? It's all too sudden. Everything's fine. Cecil, look at me. In Mysidia, we killed innocent people to steal their crystal. It was horrible. But I suppose this is my fate as a dark knight. Soon, I won't even feel remorse for my actions. You and I both know that will never happen. Still, I can't defy the king. I'm a hopeless coward. The Cecil I know would never whimper like this. The Cecil I love. You leave for mist early tomorrow, right? Yes, but don't worry. Kane's coming too. I'll be fine, trust me. Please come back to me in one piece. Thank you, Rosa. Though as a dark knight, you know we can never truly be together. Aww. Such sad. So, are you ready for some real combat? Always. Lead, lead the way. I will. And you know what? I will. <laughs> Alright, so in the town there's going to be three tre treasures as well as one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight hidden items. So, and so the Dark Knight Cecil was stripped of his command as captain of the Red Wings. He and the Master Dragoon Kane headed for the Foggy Valley and the Village of Mist. So that's like the prologue, and then this is like the opening uh, bit of story. The advent of the airship marked the realization of Baron's dreams, but also the birth of its militarism. With its Royal Air Force, the Red Wings, Baron soon reigned supreme. Now, <clears throat> excuse me. Now, as monsters multiply and stir unrest, Baron only exploits its power to collect the world's crystals. Why? Well, why not? It's something to do, right? The crystals merely shed their light in silence. Crystals don't know shit. They're just vibing. Trying to, anyway. And, uh, King Baron just keeps taking them. They're just chilling. Alright. Sheesh. Okay, so we'll head over to the uh, village, town of Baron. Alright, there is the pot in front of the inn as a potion. Um, pot inside of the inn. So we'll go ahead and grab that. I think it's this one. Yeah. And then 
pot near Rose's house. Okay. Uh, there's two in the pond. Sure, we're at in the bond. Oh, okay, right here. One, two. Alright, uh. Yeah. Gotta get back out of the water here. Oh. Wait, how the hell do I get back out of the water? Right, row. Can I, can I go back up these? Yeah, okay, there we go. Weird that you can go back up those. Alright, there is... Path through the trees here somewhere. Right there. to the outer west wall. Uh, that might have been that one that I just got. Oops. Well. Not what I wanted to do. <laughs> okay. somewhere. I think it might be down that little that little crevice area. Let's head back up through the trees. Maybe down here? Yeah, okay. That's the last one. That's the last of the hidden items. And then there's three treasures. remember where they're all at though. I think there's at least one in Rose's house. Ow, ow, ow. Nope. I guess not. Um, I don't think they're in here. Change your name with that dude there. Can't get in the weapon or armor shop yet. Item shop? No. Are they in the end? Possibly. Yeah, they are. Gosh dang it. So that's everything in the town. And then there's some grinding that we're going to want to do outside of Baron. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Uh, there are four monsters that I need to uh, kill here. A goblin, a helldiver, floating eyeball, and a sword rat. So I'll go ahead and do that and then I will be right back. Here's the hell diver. Alright, here's the goblin. There's a floating eyeball. And the sword rat. Alright, cool. So uh, we got all of the uh, mobs in the beastry for this area. And I'm pretty sure that I'm gonna put a clip there of that, so um I'm gonna go ahead and there's an item in this chocobo forest right here. Should 
Should be a Gestalt Green in here somewhere. Well, there should be anyway. There we go. Alright, so each one of these forests, I think there's five forests, should have a Gestalt Green in it, so. Might as well get it while I'm here. Alright. Uh, should be more mobs right here. Yeah. Uh, so flying eyes insectus. Hey, there he is. So it wasn't in the desert, it was actually right outside the game. Okay, cool. Alright, so, um, right outside of the Cave of Mist, let's go ahead and quick save. And, there we go. Alright, let's go to it and do it. Um, in the cave there are four treasures and the Mist Dragon, so, let's just go ahead and, uh, start heading through here. Shouldn't be any new mobs on the way through here. Just the same old riffraff. I will do my best to cut as much of the battling out as I can to make it a straight video of just walking through. Unless something like really significant happens, like I die or um, I get a really cool drop. Turn back. What? Who's there? So this is the first of the four treasures. Alright, so I have leveled up a couple of times um, just fighting my way through here, so um, I think each character maybe has leveled once or twice. They're both level 12 um, at any rate, so um, I haven't gotten any good items dropped, so yeah. Alright. So there's a chance that the goblins here can drop the goblin summon, which would be nice to be able to get it this early, but I doubt it. So that's the third treasure. Did a little backtracking there. All right, so I just got a high potion off of a enemy drop. This is the last of the treasures here. All right, so got the boss fight coming up with the mist dragon. Leave it once. So. Could that be the Phantom Beast of Mist Valley? Um, I'm going to go ahead and make sure that I'm healed up. Shouldn't take much. Alright, that should be good. Don't need to overdo it. Knights of Baron. Who are you? Leave now or suffer the consequences. Show yourself. You choose to ignore my warnings? No, because I want a quick save. Okay, there we go. Yes. We have to get the mist. We're not turning back. So be it. The mist is gathering. Alright, so this shouldn't be a difficult fight, per se. Um, when I was a kid, I remember dying here, like, several times. I think mostly because I didn't know what the hell I was doing. It was darkness. I don't remember. Ah, it's just an attack. Okay. Do I have Curse of Memory turned on? No, of course not. Oh, it's turned to mist, so... I'll miss. And I get hit with cold mist. Attacking the mist is futile. The mist will retaliate if attacked. Uh, attack when the dragon appears. Yeah. I didn't realize it was getting ready to turn to mist. Yes, 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 I know. Thank you. Come on. Returning to his dragon form. Attack now. 
Okay. Smack it in the eye with some dark and then jump on its face. In. Ooh, Cecil is not in good shape right now. Shit, it's starting to miss. There we go. Yes, I know. It wasn't intentional. Hit him with another potion. There we go. Alright, now I just gotta wait for him to turn back to Dragon Form. Battle should be over soon. A couple more hits. I don't know exactly how many more, but shouldn't be many more. That jump is boss. Can we get these two hits in before it changes? Yes, we can. I'm gonna go ahead and hit Cecil up with another potion. And I'm gonna go ahead and hit Can up with a potion. It's the last of my potions though, so. Alright. What else do I got? I got a high potion, I've got some Phoenix Downs, Hourglass, Timepiece with the same effect as the stop. I wonder if that'll keep it from turning into mist. I mean, I'm not gonna try it. My jam. Feels like it's it's missed for a very long time. Come on. Yeah, when that when that jump crits, it does some some decent damage. Oh, there we go. All right, Misty. Misty the dragon. All right, and that's it for the cave. And we're, we're gone. We're gone, guys. We're done. We're done here. All right. And then, um, yeah, the next place that we need to uh, pick stuff up is outside of the next town. The ring is glowing. Wait. The bomb ring is a bomb? Oh, no. What the? This this is why he sent us here? We destroyed the entire village. Why would he make us do this? No, mommy. My mom's dragon died, and because of that, my mom, my mom died too. What? I've heard of people with the power to call forth monsters. Summoners, they're called. Then we're responsible for killing her mother by killing the dragon. You killed my mom's dragon? We we didn't know that would happen. So, that was the king's plan, to annihilate every summoner in this village. That can't be. I'm afraid it's true. I'm also afraid we're going to have to get rid of the girl. What? That's what the king would expect. It's her or us. But she's just a child. You intend to defy the king? I refuse to carry out any more slaughter in the king's name. I knew you'd say, say that. Don't worry, I'm on your side. You are? I owe the king so much, but I can't disgrace the dragoons. So you'll join me? Yes, but we'll need the support of other nations if we're to oppose the mightiest kingdom in the land. And we have to get Rosa out of Baron. Thank you, king. Save it. This isn't for your sake. This place is dangerous. We'd better get going. What about the girl? 
We can't leave her. We have to take her with us. It's all right. We won't hurt you, but you're going to have to come with us, okay? No. Come on. We have to go now. No. Go away. Wait. I hate you. You killed my mom. Look, sorry, kid. Look, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna defend. I, I'm pretty sure that you're not supposed to attack her. Go away. Thought I could be wrong. That, that pretty much happens either way. You get ripped up by Titan, so... Don't even bother attacking her. Or trying to. Because you can't hit her anyway. Anyway. Just the two of us. She's safe. Thank goodness. Kane? Kane! I have to get her out of here. Kane, I pray that you're alive. And scene. Alright, accidentally destroyed the village of mist is an achievement that I just got. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and grind the two mobs outside of this town. And then I will see you back here when I'm done. Alright, so here is one of the uh, two that I need to find the hund legs. Um, that was weird. Um, so, the the only mob that in this area that I haven't gotten yet is a rare spawn, and I'm out of healing items, and I cannot stay, stay at the end without progressing the story, so I'm just going to go ahead and progress the story now, and I will look for the sandworm after uh, this village. So, here we go. <laughs> oh, all that being said, I have to find her a place to rest. Because this happens as soon as you walk into the town, so. Alright. And we'll get two uh, monster entries right away. Oh, she looks very pale. Is she alright? Get her to a bed, quickly. She can rest here, free of charge. Thank you. Alright, so. Um, yeah, there's going to be a little bit of story here. Hey, are you all right? My name is Cecil. What's yours? I'm so sorry about your mother. I understand if you can't forgive me. Will you at least let me protect you? Okay. And then, in the middle of the night... So we want to kill the captain first, uh, or the general first, otherwise he'll flee. Cecil, I finally found you. Wait! I'm here on the king's orders. All summoners from mist must be annihilated. Hand over the girl, now. Not a chance. Then you shall die. We'll see about that. So I'm actually going to take out two of these soldiers first. Um, also, I did not realize that my darkness move takes a big chunk of my health away. <laughs> and I was wondering why my health was getting so low, and it's because I was doing it to myself. Alright, so those guys are down. Let's go ahead and take out the general now. Call 1-800-GENERAL-NOW. Because once all the soldiers are down, if he's still up, then he will flee. So you want to take him out before you kill the last soldier. In order to get him registered in your beast tree, also to get the experience for killing him. down, and 
that that guy just like a coup de gras to self. All right. Are you okay? Yes. Don't worry about. Or she said, "Are you okay?" Yes. Don't worry about me. I won't let anyone hurt you. Promise. I promise. I'm Rita. Rita. I'm calling her Rita because that's how I pronounce it. Summer Rita has joined the party. Alright. All set. Alright, so there's only one item to get here. Hot north of the weapon shop, there should be a... Ether. Alright, so let's explore the town real quick. See what there is to see. Um, oh, there's Rosa. Rosa! Cecil! Cecil! Don't die on me! Cecil! Cecil, don't die on me! Oh, okay. To cure desert fever, you need a rare jewel called the Sand Ruby, found only in a cave where an antlion dwells. We found a girl from Baron lying unconscious just outside of town. The poor things come down with desert fever. She just keeps muttering the name Cecil over and over. Cecil? Well, that's my name. Alright, so I, I, forgot the, <laughs> I forgot that she was in there, to be honest. Alright, so let's go see if we can... Um, Get some better equipment for everybody. Um, if I get her a staff, that'll be better for her. Equip her with the staff. So. I'm going to go ahead and sell her rod. Just for that little bit of extra money. I do want to buy some healing items. Definitely on the list of things that I need to do. Um, but I want to make sure that I've got good equipment for everybody. So. Alright, so it looks like that's actually the best equipment that I can get. For now. Alright, so where is the potion shop? Over here. Wait, is it in the inn? It might be in the inn. In the inn. It is, yeah. Move old lady. Alright, so. Can't max them out, but I can get, say, 25. Um. One of those. Five antidotes. Let's grab. Yeah, we'll go ten tenths. Okay. Probably um, remove all of the like mundane purchases from this point on. So like items and stuff. Um, I might show like stuff like the um, weapons and armor and stuff, but that's about it. So I'm going to go ahead and end this here. Um, I think that this has been a fairly productive um, fairly productive uh, gaming session. So, yeah. Uh, pretty good episode, I think, so far. Um, hopefully I will remember to cut all of that together and remove all of the um, monotony. But uh, Sorry, I had a sneezing fit there. So if uh, you liked the video, please throw a like down there. Consider subscribing if you'd like to su subscribe. And if you really, really enjoyed it, um, maybe consider buying me a cup of coffee in the link down in the description. Otherwise, I hope that you enjoyed the video, and I will see you in the next one. Take care. Hey, what's up?
Thanks for watching.